Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey y'all. Welcome to a new video. If you are new to this channel, my name is Lisa and today I am going to be doing a plan with me and my B6 planner. Now this planner is from Sadie Stickers and uh, here are the leftovers. This is a kit from TaylorMade. This is just a follow-up video from my previous video that I had or the previous uh, plan with me that I did. I thought it would be fun to share with you all how I have been using the leftover stickers. Now all of the spreads that I have been doing in this planner are from the year of 2023 uh, because as you guys know I had you know my little cancer situation and I did not plan uh, for the end of 2022 and for the part of the better part of 2023 I think I jumped back into planning uh, where I had left off in 2022 so I was pretty much like, like a year behind. So instead of planning for 2023, I decided to plan for 2024 and 2023. I would do a spread for this year and then I would catch up and do a spread for last year. And that, friends, is what we have been doing. That is a long, long, long intro, I know. <laughs> Sometimes I can get a little long windy. Anywho, we are going to go ahead and jump into this spread. As you can see, I have already placed down the dates and the headers for this uh, spread. So you guys do not have to look at that because, you know, that's always the same thing. Anywho, let's go ahead and jump into this plan with me all right so um i wanted to use these torn strips for my bottom washi but the orientation of these strips are the same <laughs> even all of them are the same i was going to use the dark ones too um because i could use a dark one and then put a light one but then on the other side it would still be you know the same oh no okay let's try that you guys and see if we like that or I was going to put down this um, Oil sticker and then put some florals on top of that. I think I might do that because let's see that and then that and with the florals some florals in the middle. Is that going to be cute or no? Hmm. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should we just do the, I really want to use this. And since I've already did my date cover situation, I'm going to go with these. So we're going to go ahead and put this down. All right, now that we have that down, we are going to go ahead and put in 
the full boxes. Now I have two full boxes <laughs> left over from this sticker kit. And then I have these large pieces of deco that I want to use. So I always try to cover up this space over here, especially if I'm going to try to use this as a sidebar. So let's do that. I think I'm going to start with this one over here because I want to use the little witch over here as well. So. So this works out because the houses were so big it's almost like a full box so I am happy with that and then I just went ahead and tilted the full box over here just to you know judge it up a little bit this is gonna be our sidebar on this side today so yeah All right, there we go. I love that. Uh, I have purposely put the kitchen and the witch with her shoes and broom uh, because you can kind of see that this is the kitchen in the background. So I purposely uh, put those there so that they could, you know, sort of like match. <laughs> All right, so for the rest of this, I do have some, um, ink swatches left over, which I was so glad about that. So I'm going to fix the rest of these boxes up real quick and then I will go ahead and put in the day, oh, well, not the day today, I'll go ahead and put in the rest of the boxes. All right, to spice up the box a little bit, I'm just using the part of the bottom washi that I cut off. And then I'm gonna be using the last of the Sadie Sticker Spider Webs that I used in my last <laughs> spread. So as I can just use them up, there's no point on leaving two stickers on a sheet of paper. Might as well use it up, right? There we go. And even though I'm using some of the same uh, things that I used in the last spread, I always try to make these spreads look different. So they might be all mundane, <laughs> but I do try to make them look different. the base of this spread. I think it's so cute. I went ahead and added in uh, some of the foil little elements that I had left over and I put them in the bottom of washi and I think that turned out really really cute. I love it. And then I ended up just putting some of the uh, candy coins and uh, florals little pieces that I had left over as well and I just stuck those in the date cover area and I am loving it so far so now all I am going to do you guys is just put in some boxes because uh, like I said these spreads are from 2023 and I don't exactly have all of the notes so what I have been doing is just putting in the boxes and then when I am done with this planner I will go back in and fill everything in and put in the icons and all of that stuff and that is what has been just uh, keeping me you know caught up and you know I don't have to go back and just do 
full spreads. Anywho, I'm gonna go ahead and put these boxes in and then that is going to be the end of our plan with me. This is how I have been using my leftover um, sticker kits and I hope you guys enjoy this little video. <laughs> All right, y'all, I do want to apologize for this video going up so late. I had this done <laughs> the week of Thanksgiving, and I have just been busy these past couple of weeks <laughs> trying to get Christmas decorations up, taking Halloween decorations down, and all of the different things going on around here. So, I want to apologize for this video going up late. If you have made it this far into the video and you made it to the end, <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you so much. I appreciate it. But as you can see, I still have a little bit of leftover still left, y'all. But that is going to be the end of today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you in the next one. Bye, y'all. <laughs>